So I was planning to show you guys a little bit of something that I'm working on right now. It's crazy. There's definitely a widespread stereotype that crocheting as well as other yarn crafts are a female oriented craft but I never found a solid reason why I shouldn't do it and in fact if we go look back into history these crafts were mostly practiced by men and I think we need to break that stereotype now. I came across crochet in 2016 when uh, Kashmir was yet again in a strict lockdown and there was a complete communication blockade. Uh, the craft came to me through my aunt and I decided to try my hands on it out of boredom and curiosity but it soon became a type of mental therapy for me and uh, I have been hooked to it ever since. I was diagnosed with PSPT when I was 13 years old uh, which is a heart condition wherein my heart rate would go extremely high and I used to get these kind of attacks whenever I went through any kind of stress or anxiety. Uh, but after I started crocheting in 2016, uh, I noticed that the frequency of these attacks went extremely down. I've been reaching out to people, mostly women folk, who are familiar with such crafts. Uh, every time there's like a rush of orders so that more and more people can benefit from this venture. Uh, also I'm planning to train and employ more people to generate a bit of employment. The G20 summit will definitely help the local economy in a lot of ways as there has been a steep decline in the number of foreign tourists coming to Kashmir since the 90s and the coming of uh, the delegates from so many other countries will help to propagate the positive image of Kashmir and uh, its potential in tourism and it will also help in the local crafts and other businesses. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.